Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm going to be sharing how to see your YouTube subscriber count live. So welcome to the Esatino YouTube channel where we talk about money, marketing, and mindset. So I'm here on the dashboard right now and you probably noticed that, yeah, you can see your current subscribers here on your dashboard. But the thing is, it's not live. It's not a live counter. So let me show you where you can find that. When you are in your dashboard, you want to go to the left hand side and head over to analytics. From here on the right hand side, you can see that it has a list of the subscribers, but you can see the live count. So click on that. And then this little page is going to pop up. That is for you. This is your live subscriber count YouTube page. Now I know a lot of people like to have this on a separate computer and have it displayed. And this page will be showing you live subscriber count updates. Now it's pretty much just a simple one pager here. It just has your profile picture, your subscriber count number in large numbers there. And then it will have your channel growth for the last 28 days, which you can change. You can change that to, you know, lifetime, the last year, 2021, 2020, month, or you can do a custom. You can also click this button, which does like a collapse thing and then spreads out this number, which doesn't look that appealing. I actually like it better like this. Hopefully they'll make this page look better as time goes on. This is a new feature from YouTube and I think that it can design wise look a lot cooler, but it is cool that they are now offering this to us because if you try to go on to Google and type in YouTube subscriber live count, any of these other websites that are not actually YouTube will not give you an accurate live subscriber count. So you can try and look on all of these, but you won't actually get your live subscriber number other than in your own dashboard. So that's how you find your live subscriber count. And when you're done, you just click X out of it. And then you can go back to your regular channel analytics in your dashboard. So if I was able to help you out at all, please let me know by giving this video a like, a comment, or subscribe. All that would be very much appreciated. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.